Hello friends, subscribers and new viewers of this channel and welcome to machine learning and AI tutorials. In this tutorial we are going to explain how to correctly erase the Hugging Face cache and the Hugging Face downloaded repositories. And let's immediately explain what is the problem. I often like to play with the Hugging Face models and Hugging Face repositories. I do it like this. First of all, I create a Python virtual environment and then inside of that Python virtual environment, I download the files. And you expect that the files will be stored inside of a folder in which you created a Python virtual environment. However, that's not the case. What's usually is happening is that once you start downloading the Hugging Face repositories, they're not stored in the folder from which you call this command. Instead, they're stored in this hidden .cache folder inside of your home folder if you are on Linux Ubuntu. Namely, if you click here and if you search for Hugging Face cache, cache folder, you will see it over here. Then if you do the right click and if you do the properties, you will see this. 171 gigabytes and this is really, really large. You can see right now that currently my Ubuntu drive is almost full, only 50 gigabytes left. And that's the issue. If you do not erase the cache, the files will be just building up, the cache folder will be, will be building up and you will soon run out of disk space. So let's learn how to resolve this problem. First of all, let's learn how to locate the folder. The folder should be in home, then over here you should see .config. If you don't see .config, then you need to turn on an option to see the hidden files and folders. And let me teach you how to do that. To turn on or off the visibility of hidden files and folders, you need to click here and make sure that this option is selected. Let me show you what happens if this option is not selected, then if you scroll down this home folder, you will not see files starting with dot and these are hidden files. So make sure that this option is selected and then locate the cache folder. Here it is. And then find the hugging face. Definitely inside of this folder, one option would be to erase the complete folder. Of course, this is the brutal or very, very <laughs> rough way of doing it. You might try to do that. I don't think that you can destroy anything inside. However, there, there is an elegant option. That is, you can clearly and easily select repositories that you want to erase, since some repositories you might not want to erase. Now, if you want to understand what are these folders over here, my advice is to go to the Hugging Face website and to search for this web page called Understand Caching and to read and go through everything. So briefly speaking, you have refs. The ref folder contains files which indicate the latest revisions of the given reference. Then you have blobs. The blobs folder contains the actual files that we have downloaded. And then you have snapshots. The snapshot folder contains contain sim links to the blogs mentioned above. And then you can go over here and you can search and you can see where they are, why they're being used, and you can understand better what's happening over here. In my case, the largest folder is this one over here, and you can see that it's around 170 gigabytes. For example, this folder is much smaller, as well as these two folders, and you can see it like this. Okay, let's now learn how to erase the cache. To do that, we will need to do several things. First of all, we will need to create a Python virtual environment. And inside of that Python virtual environment, I'm going to install this library. And then after that, I'm going to call the command for erasing the cache. Okay, so first of all, open a terminal by clicking here and searching for terminal. And after you open the terminal, you need to update and upgrade everything by executing these two commands, then enter your password and wait. This will take a while and press Y over here. Okay, after that, you need to install, install the command for creating Python virtual environments. Since I don't like to install libraries in the base 
environment as well as installing even this library hugging face hub dot cli then run this command this command will install the command for creating python virtual environments then make sure that you go to the home folder and inside of that home folder create a test folder by executing this command and then let's navigate to this test folder by typing this and then inside of this test folder let's create the python virtual environment to do that simply run this command and then activate the python virtual environment by running this command and here you are you're inside of the python virtual environment Install the Hugging Face CLI library by running this command. And then finally, let's delete the cache by typing this command. And let's see what will happen. Okay. Wow. Let's see what happens. So what do we have over here? We have several models. Okay. So let's start erasing. So first of all, you can use the arrows to erase everything and you can see what's happening. I have a bunch of things over here. So let me clean up everything. First of all, I'm going to select this by pressing space, then this by pressing space, by then this by pressing space, this by pressing space, this, 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 this. So let me erase everything in order to free space on my computer since this is really, really annoying. I don't have any more free space. Let me do this, do this, do this, and that's it. Okay, now everything is being selected. And if I now press enter, magic should happen. Select revisions to delete 22 revisions uh, revision selected. And here you can see how much space will be released, around 171 gigabytes. And then here press Y and everything should be erased. So let's confirm that. To confirm that, let's go here, then let me go again to the cache folder, then find the hugging face folder, do the right click, do properties, and voila, it's currently only 12.3 megabytes, amazing. So let's now verify by clicking here, other locations, click on your Ubuntu drive, and you can see 221 gigabytes free i just released or clean up of 170 gigabytes of files i was not using and in my opinion uh hugging face is a very nice environment however people who are not familiar with computers or not familiar with the generally git and other things will be very surprised when they realize that they cannot so simply erase everything okay so let's now erase even this folder since we don't need it simply type deactivate to get out then go back and then type this rm rf and then let's type test folder over here and then let's do that and this will erase test folder and everything is cleaned up now okay that's all for today i hope that you like this video if you like the videos i'm creating please press the like and subscribe buttons also on my youtube channel you can find more than 1000 free video tutorials covering different topics such as machine learning ai programming control engineering robotics etc that's all and see you in the next video tutorial